Okay, everyone, this is a continuation of the review of the dun, 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 the EEL IP67, yes, by Leofile, which is a unusual name. Cool box. Um, it's actually almost worth keeping to put other crap into it when you're done with this. So, as everybody knows, I had the LG 800s um, who just decided to die on me, and I was very sad. And now they're basically just um, really elaborate um, earplugs. And I went ahead and I picked up the eels. And the eels are roughly, um, or eel is roughly about 50 bucks on Amazon. Alright, as you saw from the unboxing earlier, they're, they're kind of nice. There's a, um, a trick that you'll see in the commercial and that's basically you instead of holding on or, or wearing around your neck if you decide you want to be very bohemian or something you clasp this little sorry you clasp this together you wrap it like so you run these guys close now that there's a video that shows you but it can be done and you can either leave it like this or if you want to get really into it, you would just wrap it like so, double this through, stick your hand through as you spin. So again, I, I didn't show it, I'm sorry. You, uh, you get wrapped like this, you rotate like that, stick your hand through. Now this is all scary because you're like, well wait a minute, I want to put extra tension on these. And But this is how they suggest that you wear it to carry it. And it's the eel because it wraps around your arm. Now I've got a, um, a Fitbit here too. I won't lie. Um, I wore it like this today, and actually I turned it around so that the headphones were more on the outside of my hand and kind of hung down like that. And you know it's stupid, but it actually had kind of a bohemian feel to it. It was kind of cool. So that being said, let's talk about the more important parts why I get this off my wrist and you know, theoretically not break it so uh, by declipping and there's a little clip it falls apart like that and boom and the clip you see is just like I showed you that little piece there now let's talk about what's important um, let's talk about music first of all you got these on boom they are water, they are heavily sweat resistant. I took them out, and if you know about Arizona recently, you know it got really warm, and I was out there hiking in it. And holy crap, oh my gosh, well. Now, I got a little enthusiastic, and I took them into the shower with me. That is a no-no, don't do that. The uh, speakers, or I'm sorry, the microphone as it is, happens to be like right on here, if you can make out the, um, there's two little microphones. And uh, they don't like water, but fortunately I did the measures, you know, bag of rice, what have you. Um, now let's talk about use of it. The use is you have these three little very solid buttons. And how it works is one middle hold press and it comes on. It connects faster than any other Bluetooth that I have worked with. Uh, with my phone, which is still a Nexus 6. And it's impressive. It's like it comes on and the power on, connected, and like boom, you're already you're up and ready to roll. Um, one push starts music. Two push, two quick pushes brings up uh, either Siri or uh, OK Google. Uh, one uh, long push raises or lowers the volume depending on which rocker you're on, or a um, I'm sorry, a long push forwards the song or a short push raises and lowers the, the volume. It's a little hard to get used to where you know when you look at um, one of these units there there's very dedicated buttons. It's there's a lot more real estate. But um, the call quality or the um, the sound quality is good. It has a very long range and it's very clear. But you don't get that <clears throat> boom that you're looking for in say some of your more expensive models or some of the models that are just designed to give you that boom. So music wise I found these very enjoyable and I like them. Now for call quality. Um, 
Call quality is very crisp. In fact, I've been using uh, Bluetooth for a long time, and the call quality I get out of these is probably some of the best I've ever experienced. It's it doesn't feel digitally enhanced. There's no extra bass or anything added to it. It sounds like the other person on the other side. So, on call qualities, this is amazing. On music, it's really good. Um, and then of course you've got that you know little behumi and wrap it around your wrist type thing. Um, they've got a very good warranty. I uh, read in the amazing instruction booklet. Um, you know it's like over a year which is impressive um, and the charge cable does come with it it's a micro it's a USB to micro USB which is good because it means they're everywhere so my impressions now that I've been using the EEL for a while is that it is a really good answer to something like a, 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 well, to any of them out there um, I noticed that a lot of units are moving to the wireless where you, you've got wireless plugs and they go right in your ears. You know, those are probably really good. I haven't experienced them. But if you are still looking for something, because maybe you're worried about losing one of the plugs, um, or one of the earbuds, this is really a nice answer. For 50 bucks, you really can't go wrong. Um, I've been really impressed with them. So far, we're about two to three weeks into it, I think. And, um, and I like them. And, um, I'm going to go ahead and pair this up and, and load up. If you have any questions, let me know. I was going to let, I was going to take them back because I saw the new, um, new LGs and I was like, oh, that's really cool. But the call quality and the, the persistence of music and the immediate connection make these a win. So, um, again, you can look up the specs on your own, but my impressions are this is actually a really nice answer and uh, I'm happy to be using it. Again, this is already EEL. This is the IP67, and the vendor is Leofile, which is, um, I don't know what that is. Anyways, hope that helps. Bye.